This movie tells a story about a hitman, his boss, an art dealer, and a money laundering scheme that accidentally turns the assassin into an overnight sensation. One that forces her to play the art world against the underworld. This movie is an unmemorable dark comedy built on the sort of art world satire. The script has a witty and hilarious moments, but they are few and far between. There's a lot of potential for big laughs that never end up coming. The satire in this comedy doesn't exactly break any new ground, and there are many plot incredulities littering its script. Uma Thurman and Samuel L. Jackson have a good deal of scenery to chew on together, at least at the beginning. Even with mediocre material, it's nice to see an on-screen reunion between them. However, Jackson's character curiously disappears for long stretches. The dialogue strains to be clever without offering much incentive for emotional investment in the outcome. The script's send-up of the gallery world is stale, as is its depiction of organized crime. The movie feels a bit familiar and generic, especially when the focus is on the criminal underworld. It tries hard to merge elements of gritty crime drama with screwball satire, but the movie struggles to build sympathy for the collection of its characters. The supporting cast is filled with performers we like to see, however, the script does little to support them. The movie dedicates much time with plot and a lot of exposition, but ultimately it becomes too busy with the mechanics of the plan. There's even a subplot about an assassination plan that eventually proves more laborious than clever. The less you think about the logistics of the plot, the better, because it makes very little sense and is not very surprising. There's nothing exceptional about the production values to elevate the film above mediocrity as well. The movie eventually reaches its contrived finale with minimum payoff as it fails to wrangle its subplots into a cohesive story. Overall, we do not recommend to watch this in theaters. Just wait on your streaming service.